Hello, and welcome back to this Let's Play series for The Legend of Zelda Oracle of Ages. In the last episode, we entered the game, started figuring our way around. Nehru was captured by Bashan or something like that. The Sorceress of Shadows. And right now we've gone into the past chasing them. And to save the Maku tree at the moment, I need to find myself a shovel which has taken me to Ambi's Tower, the construction site. So let's have a look around here and let's keep going. Remember this is a blind playthrough. Never play this game. So not expecting a world record pace run, but definitely intrigued to know the story of this one and to uh, work through it. I'm just going to talk to as many people as I can. Hopefully I'll get lucky and someone will give me something. Da, 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 da. Clean up changed. Ah, so these are pretty much just saying the same thing over and over again. No, this one get off easy. Ah. Yes, I have the shovel. Huzzah! Finally! Let's dig up some dirt, shall we? Dig a dig, dig a dig, trio, trio, trio. And you over here, nope. What about here? Nope. Ah, oh, damn it. I don't know anything. No going past that point. Okay. I think I must have done everything I can in here, so unless I have to go through this point. Yeah, I think this takes me back to the first room I came into. Just seeing if there's anything under the soil, which it doesn't look like there is. Let's go. That is a heart container, which I can get. Oh, it's a piece of heart. No mind. But it's a start. A start on my way to a piece of heart. And I can't see on there. There must be another screen somewhere. Right, where do I need to go? I need to go to the Maku tree, don't I? I have the shovel, which means I can enter the Maku path now. I just have to find my way back there. <sighs> right, uh, let's equip that. Oh, hello. Symbol of a meeting. I wonder if it'll do anything for me. So when you press select, once you've already pressed start, it takes you to a different screen. Interesting. I'm just going to dig, see if there's anything underneath the soil at any point. See if I can find something. Anyway, let's keep looking, shall we? Nope, I can't dig that up. That's not going to help me. Can't touch the pots because they're too heavy. Dig, dig, dig. I finally have a rupee though. Ooh, I have some more rupees. You don't have any more seeds on me? Nope. Never mind. Alright, let's just keep going. Uh, can't do anything with you yet because I don't have a rare item. Whatever it is I need. Uh, I need to keep going east, don't I, to get to the Maku path. Let's go. Charge. That's the postman. I can't really do anything with him because the time stopped. Um, access dirt. Yeah, we know. But I have a shovel, so I can do something now. Anything over here that I can do? Yeah, a 
rupee at least. Get out my way! Move, bitch! Get out my way! Still can't carry them. Wait, am I even going the right way? No, I'm not, am I? Uh, I'll have a look this way at least. Chevel's house. Which is that. Although this will take me back to where I came from eventually, I'll just look around. Chop these up, see if I can get some more rupees. Probably not, but it looks good though. Let's interrupt the game of catch. I can't interfere with the ball. There we are, there's the Mako path, Maku path even. Can't go through the gate. And so it's through here. That should be a straight pass, shouldn't it? Oh. Okay. Slight, slightly different. Looks like it's an actual dungeon this time. And there are enemies. Interesting. Okay. Let's go slice and dice some keys. Or keys, however you like to say it. I've always called them keys. So in the same way you've got the plural of goose plural of goose and geese. It's the same but with a K, so. Oh choose. Oh incarnation of choose. Neat. Uh, get you out of the way. Run 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 run. Can't mm. Is there anything on there? No, nope, that's probably going to let something appear once I've hit that button at the top. So let's go get to that button, shall we? And simple puzzle. Knock you up, knock to the side. Go hit my button. Gives me a treasure chest. It was either going to be a chest or a key. Or both. A key inside a chest. It's got to be the key, because uh, that's the only other room I haven't been in. There we go. Well, that was available to me so far. So, let's keep going, shall we? Let's go back through here. All the way across. And there we go. Door shut behind me. Nothing around here. No enemies. I need to hit that button. Oh god, I've got a break in here, haven't I? I have no idea which ones to push. No, can't push that out of the way. Not that way. Not that one. It's gonna be one of these. There we go. Push you up. Push you to the side. Done. Okay, let's go. There's a piece of heart over there. Slice you up. No. Wait, hang on. Yes. Second piece of heart. Let's go. What is it? Can I do anything with this? Yes, I can. Opens the gate. And there's a map. Okay. <sighs> oh, this should take me to the top, shouldn't it? And that looks like enemies. Whee! This is the guy Baron was talking about. Get him! No, no, leave me alone! Slice you up, and there we go. We have saved the Maku tree. Link, what a nice name. And the Maku tree, you were brave. They said the Oracle of Ages convinced Queen Ambi to build a black tower. Maybe she made them attack her. Thank you for rescuing me. I will never ever forget it. 
and I promise I'll repay when I grow up. That's about all I can do. Looks like the gate's been opened. Remember, I will repay you when I grow up. Be sure to come see me. Cool. Sounds good to me. Dear, um, uh, when I grow up, I'm gonna be your bride. Uh oh. Wait, did I just get engaged to a tree? Did I just get engaged to a tree? God damn it. Well, there's a time portal at least. I'm assuming there is nothing else for me to do around here, so... Let's go through the portal, shall we? Um, Mackie Tree stands behind the cave, but I don't need to go through the cave because the gate is open. Oh, and she's remembered Link. Hundreds of years ago... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 400 years. Uh, it's a long time. Oh, uh, dear me. Why does this tree want to marry me? Baron. That's what I want to deal with. Ah, oh, dear me. So, we need to stop the Dark Tower, shall we? Okay. Baron can do what she please if she finds Dark Tower in the past, or with her dark. We can stop Baron and say no. No, you don't need to say it again. Eight Essences of Time. Okay, so there's the artifacts I'm chasing. With the flow of time disrupted, my memory is fading. What will we do? The essence is... Yol Graveyard. Ah, oh, that's the uh, thing in the east. We passed the sign for it. And then we start again. The Ender Seeds. Don't see. Oh, the, it was that thing behind the bush that I couldn't get past. Well, if we're gonna be your bride, might as well enter my bride. A Oracle of Secrets. This is the Hall of Secrets, where your secrets take form. At times and places, you will hear powerful secrets. At those times, come see me. I can give shape and form to your secrets. Neat. Sounds fun. Okay. What is upstairs? Clearly, our bride needs to shave up here. She needs to uh, do some cleaning. Look at that thick bush. Just look at it. Shocking. Shocking amount of bush on our bride. Well, let's find your graveyard, shall we? Well, some of the creatures are back at least. Oh, they're obsessed with Mary. from here, I think. Let's see if there's anything in Mary's house that I can do. Nope. Absolutely nothing. Slice you up, slice you up. And, okay, this takes me back to the Rolling Plains or something. I think it was. Rolling Ridge. But, can't do anything over here. There will be something eventually, but... No, I'm sure there will. 
You just don't know what so far. Let's just keep moving forward, shall we? Right. Um, so yeah, we'll go south. Then is it this way I need to go. There was a bush round here somewhere. There it is. Your graveyard to the east. Okay. Uh, I think I have to equip these. Ah. There we go. We've got some rupees for our trouble. Let's burn some trees, shall we? Can't do anything new. Uh, definitely can't do anything up here. Let's just explore, shall we? That looks like we need... Ah, we need a key. Great. So let's go find the grave key, shall we? Ooh, you. You look like you'll have something. But I can't even speak to you. Great. Yes, great. Can't burn that tree down. I'll have to get to the other side of it, surely. Nope. Oh, hello. No way, it's too scary. It's pitch black inside that grave beneath the tree. Well, if that's not a hint... I don't know what it is. Let's just slice and dice with it. I don't have any seeds, do I? Yeah, I need a... One of those seedy things. Whatever they were called. Ooh, another piece of heart. I don't think I can move that rock. Nope. So let's go this way. Let's burn some trees, shall we? Use my seeds. Ember! Ooh, hello. Uh, nothing up there, but let's go under here. Grave key. It is indeed. No idea about that building, but I can't really get into there just yet. But I had the key at last, so let's loop all the way around back to the entrance where I came from. Come on. Straight up again. It is indeed. Boom. Sorted. Let's go, go, go. Okay, there's a one over there. Don't think I can get in there just yet. Oh. Bloody crows. Die, crow. Just give me rupees. I don't need any more of these seeds just yet. Already at full capacity. Give me money. What's across here? Ah, this guy. Can't do anything about that. Uh, damn it. Let's go down here. Ah, this is the building we were thinking of. The spirit's grave. Interesting. Let's go. Looks like I will find something to help me move those pots in here. Which is good. Just can't be bothered dealing with uh, all of them. Now where can I go? Let's go around this way. Blobs. Ah, oh, these will be good shoes, won't they? Yep. Let's go this way. Yeah. Boom. Okay, doors open. What? Oh, this will take me back to the entrance. Ah. It won't open from that side. It'll open from the front. Dungeon map. 
very nice. So, and we've got a full map. Certainly more helpful than the NES original. Where you pretty much had to memorise where you had to go. to the right. Let's go to the right first. Yeah. Green shoes! Green shoes! Slice them up. What do we have here? I don't want the look of that. I don't want it to come chasing me. Let's take the key. Nope, it's not going to do anything, that's fine. Let's just run away, shall we? Ah, oh, there's a treasure chest. Damn it. I must be able to access it by coming through this way. But the door shuts because that path resets. That is annoying, not going to lie. So I'm going to have to do that again to get back through this way. The compass! Okay. There's a door to my left. Somewhere, but I do need to go up. Which means going all the way back round, then to the right, then up. Such a long convoluted way of doing things, and this is what the first main dungeon. Always a good start, isn't it? Right. Let's go through here. Knock that out of the way. Do I have the key? Yes, I do. Okay, there's still a lot of treasures to be found, so. I'll go that way next. Let's just have a gander. What's this way? You out of the way. You out of the way. No, nope, that's not the one I needed to push. Damn it. Um, this one down here, isn't it? This fun one. No. I didn't mean to push that across. Unless this is going to help me, which it isn't. That's definitely not going to help me. I need to push the bottom left one, I think. I'm fairly sure. No, I didn't push that one. Let's try that again, shall we? Let's have a potential discussion topic. Now, what's your guys' favourite Legend of Zelda game? For those of you who've played a wide variety. Personal favourite for story, Twilight Princess. Ocarina of Time is a close second. Um, in terms of enjoyability, Wind Waker as well is definitely up there. I mean, I haven't played a bad Zelda game. I mean, the NES one it was simplistic, but it was still really enjoyable. And I recently started playing uh, Link's Awakening, uh, Legend of Zelda 2. Not very far into it, so I can't really comment on whether that's a good game or not. But as far as favourite, Twilight Princess for me. But yeah, if you uh, have an opinion on the matter or a different one to mine, uh, leave a comment down below. Uh, let me know which one is your favourite and why. I mean, it might be the first one you ever played. It might be. Uh, well, yeah. I mean, it might be the first one you own played, uh, based on when you got into gaming. It might be the storyline, it might be the music. Because the music on some of the Zelda games has been absolutely incredible. Midna's Lament on Twilight Princess. Pretty much the entire soundtrack for Ocarina of Time, not gonna lie. One of the best for gaming. Uh, well, certainly for Nintendo games. Huge fan of Song of Storms, Rudo Valley. 
Um, now, Song of Storms is, fun fact, a uh, ringtone whenever I get a text. And it doesn't silence like a text, just go blue. It plays the entire song, so half the time I'm just letting it run. Letting it play if I get a text. Just to hear that wonderful soundtrack. Of course, there have been some fantastic YouTubers doing their covers um, of Legend of Zelda pieces. Uh, Lindsay Sterling did a Zelda medley many years ago now, before, I, mean, I think this came out around the time she was on America's Got Talent. Um, then she just blew up on YouTube and is very, very successful for herself. Uh, Taylor Davis, uh, she's done some fantastic uh, Zelda covers. Um, I'd argue her covers are best when she does collabs with other people. Um, her collabs with Lara DeWitt, uh, with Lara on piano, with Taylor on violin, they really work well together. She does some phenomenal pieces on her own, um, covers and originals. But I do love that. Smooth and the Groove, who I have uh, plugged on my channel before, um, does some amazing acapella. Um, he's done some great. Uh, his version of Gerudo Valley is brilliant. And there's been plenty others, and many who I haven't seen. Oh, God, what, what is that thing? Alright, so I can't use my sword when these things are touching me. Can I blow up you with that? Nope. No, I can't move. Get off me. Right. Slice. Ah, okay. So hack and slash with the sword. Avoid those things at all costs. Get off me. Come on. Right. Slice, slice. It would help me a lot if I had a shield right now. Oh, I, can't, I can't get out of the way. And this thing's... Yep. Yeah, I'm dead. One more hit, I'm dead. There's no way I'm surviving this. Wait. I did! With a quarter of a heart remaining. Okay, we're back to full strength. But... Oh, that was a nightmare, that battle. Okay, if I go to the left, I should be able to... Or not. Well, let's deal with it first. Boomerang. Oh, do I get a boomerang in this dungeon? I would love a boomerang right now. But I don't think that's going to help lift bottles. It's got to be something like the power bracelet or something like that, the power glove that you can get in some of the Zelda games. I think actually you can get it in all of them. I'm fairly sure it was in the very first one. That doesn't hold any secrets. Does not like this one does either. I need the key somehow. The question is, how do I get this key? Where do I get this key? Uh, okay. That one doesn't have it. Can't get through there. Right, let's go back. So I've been that way. Where else haven't I been? Uh, this way. Ah. Hang on, I have been this way, because this way leads to the boss room and there's a giant hand attacking me in here. Which, I'm going to need the boss key to get through that, aren't I? Maybe I have to kill this hand. No! I'm about to start. But I have this. What? Right. Let's think about this. Where did I need to get? I need to. I have four or five chests left in total, but there are three to the right hand side. So let's go have a look, shall we? Haven't been that way. Try not to fall off the bloody thing. Right, push that to the side. Let's go this way. Ah, treasure chest. What is it? It's a geisha seed. Okay. There's that soft loamy soil that we found um, 
outside the graves. Can use that for sure. Uh, can't go up that way. Oh, uh, fell off the thing. But it's okay, I'm here. Alright, I have the key now. Can I not go up that way? I don't know. There's it, gotta be something else to it. Oh wait, I didn't end up going this way, did I? Go up through here. And there should... Oh, well, I'm trapped in here now. Uh, let's go this way. What can I find in here? Treasure chest. Awesome. Let's go. Slice and slice. Push it. Alright. Another small key. There's a chest down there that I need to get. Question is... Well, there's still a couple of chests I need to get, but... Let's figure this out first. Alright. Um... So I've got that one down there. And there's that. So how... I don't actually know. I'm probably going to have to go across this way, aren't I? Slice. Slice. Through there. And now we have this door which we can open. But I think... Yeah, I think we should leave it here. For now, thank you very much for watching. I've been your host, Super Saiyan Blue Lucario. I want to like the Facebook page, follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Links to both will be in the description box below and are at the side of the video. Uh, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more content uploaded every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. And until next time, it's time for me to have a cup of tea.